The rebellion of the Serbs fighting in the Russian army began. Serbian sniper Dejan Beric, who recruits Serbs into the Russian army, complained about the command of the 119th Parachute and Airborne Regiment, where foreign mercenaries serve. He said this in an appeal that he published on social networks. The BBC drew attention to the record. It is noted that the recruited Serbs are fighting in the Wolf Unit, which is part of the Ryazan 119th Airborne Regiment, Beric said. He said the regiment's command treats the Serbian mercenaries like cattle, calling them gypsies and asking why they came to fight in Ukraine. Beric claims that the command did not allow the sick Serbs to be treated and did not provide them with military hardware and weapons. Thus, at the end of December 2023, the command of the 119th Regiment ordered the mercenaries to storm the positions of the Ukrainian army, giving them each two or three magazines for automatic rifles. In response to demands for more weapons, the commander, according to Beric, stated that the Serbs would capture the rest of the weapons in battle. The Serb mercenaries then refused to fight as part of a regiment demanding their transfer to another unit. After that, the Serbs, including those who had fallen ill, were declared war criminals, driven out of their dugouts into the cold and kept outside for several days without food or water. According to Beric, they also tried to force the mercenaries to take part in the assault by threats of beatings, shootings and imprisonment. In the morning of January the 8th, representatives of the military police came to the Serbs and offered them to sign papers that they recognized themselves as spies.